is up? Welcome back. Today we are going to be teaching you guys how to rig the Z-Man Turbo Crawl. This is the Bama Bug uh, size 4. I've actually never thrown these yet. I'm actually really excited to. But I've learned how to rig them. So let's go ahead. So one thing that I really like about these baits, they look really good. And this is probably the best plastic rubber whatever you call it, of any plastic lure that I've ever seen. Most of them, you can stretch it to like that and it'll rip. These guys, most stretchy plastic ever. And it's nice because when you get a bite and a fish takes off, grabs one side, flops right back into position, looks just the same. Okay, so let's get started rigging. So here I have wide gap hook. We just rig it just like a I like to Texas rig these. So you go through until that turn and pull it back out. Bring that down to there. I like to measure it out like this. You can measure it out. See? Okay, so it goes right there. Poke it through the body. There's a weedless Texas rigged Z Man Bama bug. So the poles that I like to throw this on, here is, I have this rigged up. This is my spinning reel, 30 pound line on it. Um, I have this set up as a redneck Texas rig. So it has a bullet weight and then a drop shot weight just to hold it there. And when I rig these up, most of the time I like to throw these guys with weight on them. And again, look how stretchy they are. Just that little piece that's holding the two claws together. Take that off. There you go. And again, extremely stretchy. It's insane how stretchy these guys are without ripping. Okay. Now let's repeat the process. Texas rig. Go through. This one I go a little bit less than the curve. Because this is a little bit bigger hook. Bring it up to that eyelet and wait. I like to pull it over, meet up with that weight, turn it, measure it out, go through the body, pull that guy up a little bit, there you go, there is your weighted Texas rig, craw, you can pitch these up on beds when they're spawning, small mouth, large mouth, whatever. Like, this is really nice plastic. I don't think I'll ever go through this whole package in, like, the next three years. Because something grabs it and takes off with it, boom. Flips right back into place. So if you guys are looking to get any of these craws or pretty much any lure that you need, make sure to go check out Gear Thrill Outdoors. I'll leave the link in the description. Thanks for watching. See you next time.